Baylor head coach Scott Drew and Yale's head coach James Jones. And things got going. Yale looking good off the Baylor miss. Washer Makai Mason grabs the rebound, pulls up for three in transition and gets it to go. Yale's up 34 28. Then off the Yale turnover, Jake Lindsay to Torian Prince with a two hand jam. A little hang time there. Take another look at it. Going in for the basket right there. Yale was up 39 34 at the break. Second half now. Ishmael Wainwright getting the short floater right here. Baylor's lead was 40 39. Justin Sears off the inbound pass for the baseline dunk. Then more. Blake Reynolds finds Sam Downey. There he is underneath for the reverse layup. Part of a 10-1 run. Yale's up 55-46. In the second half, things get tense in the Baylor huddle. Rico gathers. Tori and Prince exchanging words and glares. Meanwhile, Yale keeps on doing what they've been doing. Mason from outside pulls up for the jumper. He had 31. Yale's lead is at 64-51. Jonathan Motley misses, but Prince is there for the finish. 64-53. Now Justin Sears going to take the ball and get the reverse layup right here for Yale. He had 18 points, and the Yale lead was 70-64. But more from Prince. Steps back outside the three-point stripe and gets that one to go. It's Yale's lead, 72-68. More from Baylor now. They put together a late game rally. Lester Medford drives all the way to the basket. It's 74-72 Yale leading. Ishmael Wainwright hands it off to Prince for three. And the Yale lead is down to one at 76-75. With what seconds remaining, the ball turns over and Yale gets it. Take another look, 6.8 left in the game. But Lester Medford loses the handle and Yale gets the win, 79-75 over Baylor.